This is PPE Radio TV. TV. Right, so my name is Derek Clement. I've been doing hairdressing for over 45 years. Today was actually quite unique. I just spent the entire morning just giving a, a workshop. And this is Afri this is uh, um, Black History Month. So we talked about the legacy, the heritage, and the history of Afro hair today to uh, the school children in West London. It's been a marvelous day. We do this all over the place. We do this all, all across the world, educating, providing information, advice, and guidance to uh, uh, people about Afro hair. Really, today was no exception. So uh, I'm Derek Clement, the creator of um, uh, Derek Clement Hair Care System. You can find me on www.hairx.uk. My telephone number is 07852125405. Derek Clement Hair Care System. Okay. That's another style. So Afro hair can be styled into multiple different styles depends on where you are. So bear in mind, your hair is not just about uh, where you are, but also your hair grows. Another thing that I, your hair grows from, from, from your cells. So it's important to eat your veg and vegetables. Right. And hair. fruit. Yeah, yes, so question here. How long do you think it will take to do that kind of hair? Oh, this is a uh, very good question. I mean, obviously, um, this would take a long time. I would say yeah. this would take the entire day. Yeah, it looks complicated. <laughs> In fact, well, hairdressers, you're taught to do lots of complicated things. You can box break almost any hair type because all hair are the same. Yeah. Uh, we had a very famous um, Caucasian woman Bo back Derek. in the day. Uh, her name was Bo Derek. She wore braids all the time. I'm sure, I guess the teachers might know Bo Derek. Are you familiar? Were you alive then? Oh, uh, <laughs> no, no, no. Derek, yes. Well, Derek was Caucasian and she wore, she's very famous, she's a, she was of course an actress, wasn't she? And she wore braids all the time. Yeah. Um, like, how do they make it? Do they like stick it together? Oh, the braids? Great question. My wife does braids and it does take a long time. But it's, it's, do they ever have to stick it together? No, it's actually styled like that. It's used, it's a very interesting technique. Uh, so this would take quite a long time, but it's not stuck together, it's actually plaited and then fashioned like that. Yes. If you have like straight hair, do your hair like over time turn into afro? I've, I've, I've been asked this question all day today. <laughs> um, not really, because your hair is determined by your D and A. Right, so it's already set in stone, uh, but it can be, it can be styled by manipulating hair using uh, rods or tools, or maybe perhaps um, something like this, or the heat. This is old school, by the way, this is old school. What you do is put the hair strand there, and it turns around, and it, it, it takes a long time, but it can, be, it can be styled to look like an afro. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Good question. What do South American hair look like? American hair? South American. Oh, South American. Right, so South American hair, would, I think, would be very straight, like the, the, the demonstration shows earlier on. Yeah. Uh, right, so it would be very straight. It comes out of the, the follicle. Oh, yeah. yeah. So, right, so it would be very straight. Yes, next question. Have you ever done any style hair? Great questions. Um, you need to ask my wife. My wife does the women's hair, and I do the men's hair. I also do women's hair, but she does all the intricate styles like these. Yes, she can do that. Yes, yeah. can be done. Uh, yes. if, you, if, you have, if you have to make that kind of upper hair, how would your hair feel? It would feel actually quite interesting, really, because it's a, it's a wonderful design, as you can see. And so I guess this would be, this would be done for a special occasion. This would, this would have been maybe for a wedding ceremony. So just for an occasion. You, you wouldn't be allowed to touch it. Though. No, you can't touch it, no. Women don't like their hair. Can you style a beard? Can I style a beard? Well, yes, it do. My beard is actually style. I do my beard almost every morning. I've got my product line. And what I do every morning, I spray the beard like this to make it nice and soft. And I use my famous Afro comb. And I do this every day, every morning. In fact, throughout the entire day, I do this. So yes, you can style a beard. Good question. Does it cost a lot? I think most hairdressing services does cost because uh, it's time consuming. So this could take practically an, 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 an entire day. 
So, this might be 100 pounds. <laughs> yes? Sorry? Right, so at the moment, we've, we've had multiple shops. At the moment, no, because COVID put, us, put an end to that. So what we now do, we are focused on manufacturing. So we are manufacturers. So we manufacture products. So we, we spend a lot of time doing things like these, going around the country, educating and empowering people with regards to their hair care needs. Yes? Can children have hair like that? Oh, absolutely. I mean, yes. assuming the hair, assuming the hair is afro type, the afro hair type, of course it can be done. Yes. 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 